Let's not forget that. We've grown numb to imagery of death and demise. Blind to St. Paul till he saw a Syrian sky miles away. Wars praying on the tearious eyes. Our deaf ears still ain't hearing the cries. Why? Is it even worth asking anymore? Guilt is but a swinging door with crooked men on either side, cushioning each other's fall. Orphans hiding from a devil with dark wings, and writers with a conscience feel a pluck at our heartstrings. But very seldom do we bother to speak. Led the believer, rendered powerless by fatherless creeps, bastardized politicians while our daughters beseech us to let them flee these borders in peace. I wonder if these sad scenarios will still remain as commonplace when I'm a father. Want to face the law without regrets, I could have tried harder. Quranic verses, we can all live or die by. Yeah, they tell you, what I want. A generation of our future's parents robbed of their role models and bottle in the sanger in until they explode on a road to a dead end paved with empty promises told by our head men who fold on any armistice. Sell the weapons to finances, ever decadent highnesses, surpluses and minuses. We're stuck in the rhinus of war torn horizons and forlorn surprises of which border to cover and if mortals will smother as if all of the other shh that dictators can stick you with wasn't enough for brothers who live within this conspicuous state. Sore thumbs, sure crumbs can cure hunger, but what are the post traumatic stress a three year old will undergo in Baghdad or Gaza? Knowing that they buck that, growing up to buck back like give him his chain, saying, that is no surprise. Never got to hear it from his usra, in my usra, usra. So you keep your eyes on the street. I worry about what's below it. We're paving over a mass grave, no markers to show it. The last words of the lad will bid their age, Baba know it. His heart of darkness could con radical <coughs> Marxists and poets, missing the mark of heroics, listening hark to the stoic, yet transcendentalist flowing. The Emerson and Thoreau at the same moment, blow it. Blame no one and grow with your shame, tiptoeing through it. They sights peak with a hole in our brains. I wish I could laugh now, but it wasn't funny. The way they cut up our maps, bound and divvy up money, that wasn't theirs to begin with. But our leaders were dimwits, too conceited to see that they couldn't beat them and win, with little means to defend. Our people's under attack, tact. It seems that our wrens are seen faded to black, Mahat. I dream with a pen, because my reality's all, ah, don't mean to offend. Repent. Oh, Allah, ah.